That's it. Left the office for the last time. I'm walking a route that I used to walk many, many days of the week to go to meetings, to meet up with a friend for coffee at Gales on the High Street. The last walk feels good. I always choose this route because the people who live here all employ gardeners and the flowers smell really beautiful in the summer, which makes a change from in lorries outside the office that I will never have to go back to again. It's a strange feeling being aware of last times. I think in some ways I quite like when you you don't really know when the last time was. then it doesn't hold as much significance as all the time that led up to it. <laughs> I always enjoy counting the jaguars along these roads. I've spotted two already. recognised anyone yet. I was half expecting to see people I know. To my right there's a um, private garden square someone was playing tennis. I can hear some children playing games. To my left I've just passed a, a beast pug looking like he's struggling in the heat. I remember walking down here on my my first kind of excursion from the office. There's an overhang of ivy and I remember putting my hand up in it and scratching my finger, expecting it to be softer than it was. It's funny how the geography of the world that you inhabit, your sort of microcosm shifts over time. I remember then that I had no sense of where I was, where I'd come from and gone to on that journey. And now I think I could calculate the number of left and right turns and the approximate time to each corner. I'm quite relieved to feel that the thing that I am feeling is hopeful 
I think. It's a very small feeling. I don't really feel that much. Maybe it's a little bit mixed with relief. A bit like I'm going to be walking down metaphorical paths lined with flowers as opposed to sitting next to the bin lorry where I have been for the last year. I think we'll leave it there.